Joining us now on MSUEagles.com, the Profit Tandem. And no, we're not talking about Ty today, but we'll mention him here in just a minute. Glenn Profit and Ryan Profit from Low Sporting Goods, not only the father and brother of a uh, former Moorhead State men's basketball player, and it sounds strange to say former at this point, but uh, we're obviously here at e Eagle Trace today for the annual MSU Athletics Golf Outing. And Glenn, we'll start with you. We were just talking a few minutes ago. You and your company have uh, been involved with Moorhead State Athletics for about 20 years. And just talk about uh, how you guys are involved, some of the services you provide for the athletic teams. Well, the uh, uniform aspect, we cover all the uniforms, equipment, uh, basically anything that they play with, we, we get it for them. Ryan, you guys have stores in both uh, Corbin, Kentucky and London, Kentucky, and, and you're obviously part of the family business. Talk about your role with the company and where you travel and some of the organizations you work with most frequently. Well, after I graduated from UK, I sort of started at the store for about six months, but I've been working there on and off ever since uh, over the summers for about oh, five, six years. Um, I, I service most of central Kentucky from Jesmond down through Rowan, uh, but mainly in just the 64 and 75 corridor. Um, just doing what my dad's done. I'm third generation following sort of in everybody's footsteps. Talk about uh, today's golf outing. You guys both probably know a lot of people associated with Morehead State Athletics, but uh, seeing some old friends and meeting some new ones, I guess. That's definitely right. One of them coming up right now. Uh, his son is one of uh, mine and Ty's really good friends, Lee Cheney. You know, there's a lot of great people out here just uh, getting to come back and associate and uh, fellowship with those. I mean, you can't, you can't ask for a better day. Glenn, obviously uh, you and your wife and, um, and Ryan attended almost every Moorhead State men's basketball game this past year, home and road. You guys were uh, in and out of airports and on the road, putting in a lot of miles on, on the vehicles. But just talk about the excitement of following Ty his senior year and, and what the Eagles did. And the year before, I'm sure, is a season that will stick with you guys for a long time, the NCAA tournament victory over Louisville and Ty's involvement with that team. Well, you know, as a father, you couldn't probably ask for any more. Um, we've been following Ty since he was in the, well, since he was born, but he started playing um, competitively, I guess, when he was in the third grade in AAU, and, and we very rarely ever missed a, a basketball game. My wife sometimes had to work, but since I don't have to work for a living, I can get away. So. <laughs> but anyway, uh, yeah, it's, it's really special, and, and Moorhead's always going to hold a, a soft spot in her heart. Great people, great memories, and uh, great memories yet to come. Last weekend was a big weekend for the entire family with, with Ty getting married. Uh, was it a high school sweetheart, Kelly? High school sweetheart. Okay. Uh, Just talk about that experience. I know you guys had a great time and a large crowd uh, down there in the London Corbin area. Yeah, we had a little over 400 people that came out to our house and, and uh, we spent many, many days uh, fixing the place up. We had bales of hay for people to sit on and tents and, and we had you know everything that Callie could dream of for her wedding. It's great. Um, she, uh, she's been in our family since uh, probably uh, she was 15 years old. Her and Ty started dating. Actually, we didn't know how young she was whenever he did start <laughs> dating her. But anyway, she's part of the family, and, and, and we're really proud to have her. Ryan, final question for you. How's your golf game? How's Dad's golf game? Would you guys agree on each other's golf games? Yes, it's pitiful. <laughs> uh, <laughs> just getting to come out and... Uh, play a little bit that beats work any day so but it's fun you can't ask for a better day a little warm today but yeah anytime you can get out and golf and especially for an event like this it's it's always a good day well they're playing with two good men from the uh, Moorhead State Athletic Department Chris LaPole from the athletic training staff and John Eric Turk Wendell from uh, the compliance and operations crew. So, and we're cool. sponsored by CarMax. Okay, there you go. <laughs> Glenn and Ryan Profit. Thanks, guys, for joining us right. and enjoy the rest of the day. All right.